There. The keys are on the hook, so Clyde knows right where to find them. And I see fin pigs already. I'm sorry, what? how can a fish sit in a chair? It seems very strange. <laughs> there is some weird juju going on here. <laughs> can we take the keys back? I want them. Hey, bro. Oh, that was clever. Squidception. All right, we need the number eight fin pick, he said. This must be the fin pick Clyde needs to give the mayor his makeover. We'll soon find out. I'm fin picks. I, I, are we, can, can we talk about this for a bit? What? What do you need a comb for your fins for? I feel like your fins don't really need a comb, but, uh, you know what, video game logic. Let's just go with it. Do, 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 do. I feel like this is Blue's Clues, where you, they're moving and the background is moving instead of them actually moving. What are you playing? <laughs> Jugs! You're good! Not as good as I should be. I'm still one jug short. And this glass bottle is no substitute. I wouldn't need this bottle at all if I had another jug. This guy looks, seems a little off. <laughs> what are you playing? Jugs? It's like, um, okay. That seems like a very strange thing to do. Underwater. <laughs> oh, taffy stand. Let's go here instead. Let's go in here instead. This is where it's happening. Hi, I'm Freddy Fish, and this is my friend Luther. Hi there! My name's Kipper! She seems chipper. <laughs> also, I thought Kipper was a British dog. Not a... I don't even know what fish she is. The octopus just stole her ketchup to put it on his hot dog. Without asking. And then did it again for his hamburger. This octopus is the worst! <laughs> Can we have a free taffy? It's a taffy making machine! Yum! Vanilla! The thriller of vanilla! So, um. Why is it in every adventure game it's just giving out free stuff? How are these businesses staying in business? You're, you're as bad as Mr. Pops. <laughs> also, she's literally just like, oh, customers, whatever. She's just... <laughs> she's really just searching the internet for cheat codes. to <laughs> Cheat codes for the latest games. As well as tips on how to improve her Super Smash Bros. performance. Do you eat a lot of taffy? I love all this stuff. Can't you tell? Taffy is more nutritious than they have you believe. Really? Sure! You can just blend the other food groups right in! Easy! I don't want to be rude, so I won't say what I wanted to say. Give me a free vanilla taffy. I know either Freddy or Luther can eat the taffy, but I think it's random. Coffee, eh? We could try it. Is there any purpose to this taffy, or is this just purely cosmetic? Yuck! That's a horrible flavor! Keep in mind, they're little kids. They don't like coffee. <laughs> coffee? Yuck! Yeah, I kind of feel the same way. I'm not a fan of coffee. What the heck is a Marionberry? Marionberry. Do all the mayors get a fruit named after them? <laughs> yep, Mayor Berry. There's also Senate Berry, Congress Berry, President Berry, Governor Berry, and Supreme Dictator <laughs> Berry. I want Lufer to eat some. They actually like different flavors, from what I remember. Yum! 
I found the winner! Why is Luffer not eating anything? I'm in the thick of it now! You mean we're in the thick of it? Briny shrimp? That is the... that we have found it. We have found the worst flavor of taffy. Briny shrimp? Now we're talking! So yeah, so I think this is one that Luffer likes and Freddy hates. So maybe Luffer will go after this one? Nope, Freddy's eating it anyways. I know there's a way to make Luther eat it. Yuck, what a terrible flavor. Yeah, something should not be taffy flavors. Briny shrimp is up there. Kiwi crunch. What makes the crunch? It says kiwi crunch. Hmm, tangy. What? I need to figure out how to have Luffer eat these before I play this with Marty. <laughs> Remember when Artie actually used to play games? Yeah, good times. Instead, we're just goofing around eating taffy. Blech. That tastes awful. Kiwi's great! Although, I guess it could be polarizing. Nope! Nope. We have... we're out. You're good. Not as good as I should be. I'm still one jug short. That's the same exact dialogue we had earlier. I love jug band music. This isn't even music. Glass bottles can't hold tune. Why are you using it? Because I'm missing one jug. If I had a jug, I wouldn't need this glass bottle anymore. He's not that good at all. It's it's not music. Even if he was playing, it's it literally just like boom, boom, boom. Like that's not music. That's not music at all. It's the claw. It says the claw. Yes, it does. I'd love to try to win something from the claw machine. It only costs one purple sea urchin to play. I'd rather get glue, though. At least if I pay one purple sea urchin to Gillian, I, at least I know what I'm getting ripped off for. At least I'll get a consolation prize. The claw will probably just eat your money and then not get anything. Do, 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 boom, do, boom, boom. Hello, Mr. Turtle. Oh, we're, fi we're finally at the end of this long Hello corridor. There. I'm Earl, the map specialist. Nice to meet you, Earl. I'm Freddy, and this is my pal Luther. I feel like every character in this is voiced by a character who's like by a voice actor who voices a lot of other humongous entertainment characters. You must be straining your eyes. I lost my glasses in the tide pools out there by those mud skippers. How can you see your maps? I've made do with this microscope lens. That's terrible. If you find my glasses, I'll be able to read maps again. We'll help you find your glasses. Thanks. How does this turtle have hair? That's what I want to know. Something's not right here. Yeah, it's literally they're like pulling a Steve from Boost Goods where like he moves his feet, but he's not actually moving, but they just have the background scroll. This is basically the same thing. That's okay. It's cool. Let's pay the mayor another visit. Here you go. This should be the right fin pit, Clyde. Ooh, you're so efficient. <laughs> we only ate five flavors of taffy before now, coming can back. Can we finish the mayor's makeover? But of course, I'll only be a moment. What are you going to use it for? You didn't cut anything. You didn't cut anything. All done. See you tomorrow, Mayor Marlin. Splendid, splendid. You have a daily makeover? I mean, he's not doing anything, so I get it. Oh, this is like the actual mayor's house. That's right, because his barber shop was elsewhere. Wow, all right. Um, that happened. So he 
He stroked his fin with a specific comb, which didn't do anything, snipped nothing, and then was like, All right, Mayor, <laughs> see you tomorrow. <laughs> oh, great. Hey, bro. What a fantastic do. Why, thank you. I feel it's my civic duty to look my best. The things a new do can do. It's not new, it's exactly the same. The Emperor has no clothes, people. Also, I love the subtle commentary on our, our nation's politicians. <laughs> it's very, very subtle, but I, I appreciate it. I, I appreciate it because it's very subtle. Mayor Marlin, we have a permission slip we'd like you to sign. It will allow us into Coral Cove Park so we can solve the mystery of this terrifying sea monster. Huh? All right. There is a sea monster terrorizing the citizens of Coral Cove, isn't there? Uh, yeah. It's kind of like the number one priority right now. There, people are literally about to riot. <laughs> That's one way to write your signature. <laughs> Thanks, Mayor Marlin. Now, Officer Beverly will let us into Coral Cove Park. It looks like Freddy's threatening him. <laughs> wow. Good luck to you both. Oh my gosh. The citizens of Coral Cove are lucky to have you here in times like these. The thumbnail wow. opportunities are endless. I love it. <laughs> All right, thanks, Mayor. Um, you can enjoy looking at your reflection some more. I'm gonna head out. So we could go straight to the park, but there's still more of the world to explore. We haven't even gone back here yet, and there's a lot to explore back here. It's all starting to come back to me. Hello, I'm Rollo. Who are you? Nice to meet you, Rollo. I'm Freddy Fish, and this is my pal, Luther. Pleasure meeting you both. So there are like happy clowns and sad clowns, but I'm pretty sure Rollo here is the first example of an apathetic clown. He sounds so bored and done with life. Let's hear a knock-knock joke. Knock, knock. Who's there? Nova. Nova who? Nova, good place to eat around here. <laughs> You're funny. No, he's not. Let's leave. Let's leave this clown to his woes. Excuse me, I'm Freddy Fish, and this is my best friend Luther. Who are you? My name is Al B. Core. I am in the business of card trading. Pleased to meet you, Al B. Core. All right, hey Al. You must really like trading cards. Oh, I do. It is what I live for. You need to find a better reason to live, dude. Like, that's sad. Make some friends. <laughs> we say as we run off. It's a purple sea urchin. At <laughs> last! Freddy. We finally found one! But what do we spend it on? We could get glue? We could get a tr we could try out the claw machine and probably just get our money eaten. Or we could buy whatever he had. I oh I didn't even see what Rollo had back there. I didn't care. <laughs> hey oh it's a trading card. Look, it's a trading card. Hey! That's my roof! Your roof is made out of a trading card? Until I get one like this top of the line cold jake <laughs> roof! Yes! That's my roof! <laughs> Until I get one that's like the guy giving me the thumbs up on the Maybe boom! we can help you find an orange cone shaped roof. Then I wouldn't need this hokey trading card roof. My home is my castle, and a little privacy is all I ask for. Sorry, bro. Sounds like you're having a rough time. Let's let's leave it there. I uh, he, uh, he's a single dad trying his best. I I, I feel you, buddy. All right, let's let's let him keep his limited edition uh, Pablo Sanchez baseball trading card. And oh, whatever purple sea urchin. Here's where they're all hiding. <laughs> it's Easter Island. Wait till the geysers are at the same height as the next one before you leap. Otherwise, you won't face plant. Actually, I just think that it won't let you leap without it. I can't jump that high. 
You could before you said that. That's true. No, I can't reach it from here. I still just can't jump, reach just leap. You can take the fall damage, Freddy. I still can't reach You're not Mario from the original urchin. Donkey Kong. I got it. Way to go. Thank goodness Freddy can breathe on land. Whoa. Thank goodness that quick warped us back. <laughs> All right, now we don't have to even choose. We can get glue and try out the claw machine. And get our money eaten. This is great.